On CCTV International, I'm Tony Perkins in our on-the-spot studio right across from the Olympic Games site in Beijing. And we're happy to be joined in our studio by Sun Yue, who is uh, a uh, professional basketball player now signed with the Los Angeles Lakers. Congratulations. You just uh, signed a two-year deal yeah. with the Lakers. You were drafted by the Lakers uh, last year. Yeah. You know, and uh, and uh, over the year, you had an opportunity to play against the top NBA talent, including here at the Olympic Games. So, uh, first of all, what, do, what is it going to be like to play at that top level, at the NBA level? You know, the, first of all, uh, I, the NBA is always my dream. I think that that will be the average basketball player, the top dream. I think um, for me, as uh, my first dream country is to play the NBA, and uh, then I will I will work hard uh, to the play well in the NBA. I, I will try to my best. Uh, did you watch a lot of NBA basketball here in China on on television uh, growing up? Yeah, yeah. When I when I since I like uh, nine or ten years old, I start watching basketball in the t on the television like. Uh, you know, the, uh, when I started watching basketball, it was uh, Michael Jordan, the Chicago Bulls. Uh, we, uh, you know, when I watched it, the, I said, how can, how can he do that? It's kind of unbelievable, you know. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's why I'm starting to like basketball. All right. Uh, you're six foot nine, and you'll be playing point guard in the NBA. Yeah. Uh, and uh, to be, have that kind of height uh, is a real advantage uh, for, for point guards in, in, the, in the big league. Um, but uh, point guard is uh, is a position that you're accustomed to. Have you always played point guard? And always. Is, uh, and, and what what do you have to do as a point guard player? You know, uh, be a point guard is uh, to I, I I have to say that it's a very hard job. You know, you have to do everything on the court. You have to uh, m uh, help the help the coach make the right decision and help the teammate make them better. And uh, you, uh, anyway, you have to do uh, all the things on the court. How tough is it to keep everybody happy? Um, maybe first of all, I have to win a game. Then if I lost game, I think nobody will be happy. <laughs> uh, the, uh, the players that you'll be following into the NBA, Yao Ming and yeah. Yi Jian Lian, um, have, you, have you had a chance to talk with, uh, with Yao and Yi about uh, what they are able to do at, in the NBA? What have they told you about uh, what's most important for you to learn uh, about NBA basketball. Actually, I think uh, uh, me and uh, you and he, we, we are we are different way. You know, they are, they are center was a different position. And uh, uh, but the one thing gonna be same uh, between us it is is uh, you have to work very very hard to stay on that league. You know, that league is the uh, best player in the world play there. So you, if you're not working hard, you will, you will get out very soon. Mm -hmm. Um, you played uh, in the NBA Summer League uh, yeah. and had an opportunity uh, against, uh, to play against uh, Orlando Magic, I believe, uh, in, in uh, some time in the, in the United States. Uh, what were the important things that you learned uh, from, uh, from having your experience against uh, the same NBA players, in many cases, that you'll be playing on a regular you know, basis? Actually, when I, when I start basketball, uh, the you know, professional basketball career, uh, when I, in my uh, club team Ocean will will play. Uh, we start play the basketball with the you know, black black people. You know they, they play basketball the very fast, very stronger, and uh, and they can run up and down. Like, you know 48 minutes not not being tired. So uh, that's uh, that's my experience when I play against American players. So uh, also before the before the I think it's 2005. With the whole team, the Ocean Club team, we go to the NBA. Uh, no, we go to the LA play ABA league, mm -hmm. and uh, this also gave me a lot of experience of uh, how to uh, play against American players. So uh, last year when we when we were a national team, we go to the play summer league. I think uh, this is more easy than the, another Chinese player because I I I getting used to already. So I think. Uh, um, summer league player, they have they have the more strong body, more fast, and uh, the skill more good. So I think uh, uh, that will be good experience for uh, before my I um, play the NBA. Mm. Uh, it's uh, speed. You have to be fast. Yeah. And you have to be strong. Yeah. Uh, those are the, the the main are those the two main things that you found uh, that you have to be as a as a top league basketball player. Uh, you know when I, when you play a top 
probably in the basketball, um, you have you have improved your everything. You know, you have uh, improved yourself every day. So you cannot just improve one thing because uh, um, if you fast, maybe somebody fast than you. You have to use another one issue to be the. You know, like uh, if he faster than you, you have to stronger than him. So, you know, you have always improve your every skill. Um, there's not a whole lot of uh, first-year players who get uh, who get time out on the floor. You may have to sit on the bench for a while. Um, you know, are you ready to to play that role? Are you ready to uh, sit and observe, to watch for a while before you get an opportunity? I think um, that will be the coach decision. I will I will do do maximum in the practice and uh, make him happy. Maybe <laughs> let me play more minutes. But uh, you know, uh, if uh, if uh, they see me on the bench, that's normal. Because uh, all all rookie first year, first year will be do the same thing. But uh, if like that, I will I will have more time to work on my skill and improve myself. So I think uh, I will handle. It. Which point guard in the NBA right now? Uh, do you look at uh, as the best and, and somebody you can look at on the floor and learn a lot from? I think um, I will be LeBron James because he's uh, uh, right now in the league. He's uh, I think he's a uh, uh, unselfish player and uh, he want, he w he wants to share the ball with teammate and uh, he also can do anything on the court. That's what I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. um, and when you look at uh, the way the NBA playoffs uh, happened uh, this year, and you had the the Lakers, uh, you know, doing so well, um, when you go and to join that team, uh, what will you be uh, thinking? I mean, you're you're very lucky to be able to play for the the top one of the top teams in the league, uh, the top player in the league, in Kobe Bryant. Uh, uh, will you be? How how hard will it be to keep from being intimidated or scared to to be out there on the floor? You know, the ball, uh, first of all, I'm very happy to play against the best player in the league, but, you know, also at the same time, you have a lot of pressure. You know, you have, you have, uh, how to say, you have to uh, do your best to make a team better. You cannot go to make a team worse, then uh, nobody will be like you. So that, that will be the big pressure for me, but uh, I, I, will do my, I will try to do my best. Okay. Sunye is with us on, on the spot on CCTV International. We're going to continue the conversation with him right after the break and talk about his Olympic experience with the China national team. So stay with us.